femoral nerve. It is the chief nerve of the anterior compartment of thigh. Root value. It is formed by the dorsal division of anterior primary ramae of L2, L3 and L4 spinal nerves. Relations. It lies within the substance of psoas major. Number two, it emerges on the lateral margin of the psoas major by piercing the muscle. So it pierces the lateral margin of the psoas major and it exits. It runs deep to inguinal ligament. It runs deep to inguinal ligament to enter the thigh. In the thigh, it lies in the iliopsoas groove, where it divides into anterior and posterior divisions. Branches and distribution. From the main branch, it gives two muscular branches, one for iliacus and another for pectineus. Branches from the anterior division. The anterior division has one muscular branch and two cutaneous branches. It gives muscular branch to soft ovaries and the two cutaneous branches are medial cutaneous nerve of thigh and the intermediate cutaneous nerve of thigh, which supplies the anterior and medial part of the thigh. Skin over the anterior and medial part of the thigh. Posterior division. The posterior division gives muscular branches to rectus femoris, vastus medialis, vastus lateralis, and vastus intermedius. And it also gives muscular branches to articularis genum. The muscular branch to rectus femoris sends an articular branch to hip joint and the muscular branch to vastus intermedius sends a branch to articular branch to knee joint. So the femoral nerve supplies articular branch to hip joint and knee joint. The cutaneous branch of the posterior division is the saphenous nerve. It accompanies the great surface vein. It supplies skin over the medial side of the leg and medial border of the foot till the great toe. Applied anatomy. Injury to femoral nerve results in paralysis of the anterior compartment muscles of the thigh, which is a powerful extensor. So loss of extension of the knee joint occurs. Sensory loss over the medial side of the leg and the medial border of the foot due to injury to the saphenous nerve. Obturator nerve. It is the chief nerve of the medial compartment of thigh. It arises from the lumbar plexus root value. It is formed by the ventral division of L2, L3 and L4 spinal nerves. So it is formed by the ventral division of anterior primary ramae of L2, L3 and L4 spinal nerves. Relations. Number one, it lies within the substance of psoas major. Number two, it emerges or exits by piercing the medial margin of the psoas major. Number three, in the pelvis, okay, it lies on the obturator internus muscle. Okay. In case of female, okay, in the pelvis, it is related to lateral surface of the ovary. It enters the obturator foramen. 
Okay, uh, the obturator canal along with the obturator in artery and enters the thigh and it's by supplying the medial compartment or director compartment muscles of the thigh. So the thigh it divides into anterior and posterior divisions, branches and distribution. Branches from the anterior division. The anterior division gives muscular branch to the tenius, gracilis, and adductor longus. The posterior division gives muscular branches to obturator externus, adductor magnus, and adductor brevis. Okay. The adductor brevis may be supplied by the branch from either anterior division or the branch from posterior division. From the posterior division, there is a branch which arises from the posterior division known as descending genicular branch. Okay. It runs to the popliteal fossa where it ends by supplying the knee joint. It also gives articular branch to hip joint. Applied anatomy. Injury to obturator nerve results in paralysis of the adductor compartment muscles or the medial compartment muscles of the thigh. So this results in okay, difficulty in the adduction of thigh or it results in loss of adduction of the thigh.